hello friends as we used this thing like in the next in the previous video actually like for the sum function I showed you in the previous video now in this video I will show you that how you can create a 2d clustered column uh, you know chart in Microsoft Excel so for example you have values you can see like we have product 1 product 2 product 3 and same like 4 and 5 and here we have the values like in Jan 2019 uh, the product solar like 63 and Feb and March for each product you can see values according to the uh, months so how you can create a clustered column chart so select these rows and columns according to the values then go to the insert tab and here you can see you can click on recommended charts or here you can see insert column or bar chart so here you can see 2d column as I told you 2d clustered column so use this chart type for to compare values across a few categories so you can select this one or this one uh, but right now we will select clustered column so clustered column and here you can see like this one the values are here so this is the chart title you can uh, double click and products uh, you know products values for the Jan 2019 to March 2019 so here you can see like product one we have uh, if you click so you can see entire thing is here so product one like in Jan you can see there are 63 sales and in Feb you can see like uh, there are 43 sales and you can see it showing like in the title uh, highlighted like value 43 and here also you can see like 33 so same thing you can see here like this value is too much like the 90 for the product 3 and uh, the uh, month is uh, you know Feb so product 3 and uh, month is Feb 19 so if we change this value you can see this will change for example it is only 15 so you can see it will change same thing like if you want to change any value you can change and here it's showing like Jan 2019 so it's blue and uh, like this is orange and this so you can see so this is on bottom you can make it on top okay and these things you can change so like this you can create you know uh, this column you can also use more options if you double click like you can uh, fill this chart with solid fill you know so the color like if you want to change you can select any other color from here like you know what color you want to apply you can change border if you want to fill you can also fill with the solid line and uh, width like the border width you can change so these things also uh, you can control and if you want to apply like shadow you can also add shadow you can see a shadow will appear here so you can also apply this one see this thing so it's very easy like you can apply the things to the entire uh, chart I hope you have learnt like even like from here you can see you can also control design so thank you very much for watching uh, this video please subscribe to the channel and also share the video with your friends so they can also learn new things thank you very much once again